The Blue Ridge Music Center really is a jewel of the Blue Ridge Parkway. It's a facility that has a visitor center, a small theater, and an amphitheater that holds 2,500 people on a beautiful hillside at the foot of Fisher's Peak. We also have a new museum called The Roots of American Music that tells the story of the music of the Blue Ridge Mountains, how it got here, and how diverse and important it is to this region. Music is such a big part of the culture, and part of the purpose of the Blue Ridge Parkway is to interpret the natural, cultural, and historic features of the Southern Appalachians. I think that speaks to how important this particular strand of music is, and it really does a wonderful job of telling the story of this music how people settled this area and the music influences they brought. If you're interested in the music, you can literally spend easily a day in there. And to have that as a museum, in addition to the beautiful amphitheater, that's a real treasure. People can always catch live music here on a daily basis. We have performances from 12 to 4 every day, seven days a week, featuring traditional music, live music in the breezeway. We have a great website where people can get the full schedule, blueridgemusiccenter.org. We have uh, our main stage concert series running uh, from the end of May through mid-September, and uh, those take place every weekend. So we do about 16 main stage concerts. Plus we have several uh, fall heritage series concerts in our small theater, which uh, feature really intimate settings where people can hear and learn about traditional music and culture. I mean, you're talking about a major facility within the National Park System devoted to this wonderful heritage music of the Blue Ridge, and that's really special. Support for On the Crooked Road was provided by the Appalachian Regional Commission with additional support from these sponsors.